Joseph. I mean, how could you? I thought it was the right thing to do under the circumstances. The right thing to do? To give our two boys what's his name from Nazareth. His name's Jesus. I don't care what his name is. What I care about is you giving away our family to him without telling me. I'm telling you now. Yes, but it's a bit late now, isn't it? And there wasn't time before. You could have made the time. So what was I supposed to do? Bring the body back here and say, what about giving this chap a birth in a, a, our family grave? I just don't see why you had to get involved. Because he needed a tomb. And we need a tomb. Not as much as he does. Why? Because he's dead. <laughs> and we'll be dead too someday. What are we supposed to do then? Huh? Not a lot, I should think. Oh, you never take me seriously. Sometimes I wonder why I'm married to Joseph of Arimathea. Oh, look. I'm sorry if I've upset you. <laughs> but what's done is done. We can always get another two. That one was special. Yes, I know, it meant a lot to you. Well, it should have meant a lot to you too. It was a wedding present. <laughs> Only your mother would give a two for a wedding present. Don't speak about my mother in that tone of Sorry. Voice. It was very thoughtful of her. I'm sure it was, but I just didn't know what to say when she led us out to look at it. Great. Just what we've always needed. Or, well, great. Can't wait to try it out. <laughs> Anything would have been better than what you did say. Oh. You so told, don't start on You that. told her she could use it any time she liked. <laughs> what I meant. I was... know what you meant. You never did like my family. Look, there's plenty of room left in it. Ew. Oh, you're not suggesting we could still use it, are you? Well, I don't see why not. Well, for my dead body. <laughs> <laughs> now look, that man was a common criminal. Nonsense. So why was he executed? Those are trumped up charges. Ooh, you're not one of his followers, are you? Well, I just thought that some of the things he said were interesting. Interesting? The man was off his head. It wasn't. He claimed to be the Messiah. Now, if those aren't delusions of grandeur, I don't know what are. Perhaps he was the Messiah. So why couldn't he afford his own tomb, huh? Yes? Excuse me? Excuse oh, no, me? Oh, no, sir. <coughs> I'm looking for Mr. and Mrs. Joseph of Arimathea. Yes, yes. 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 I'm from Gethsemane Garden Maintenance. We look after the plot in front of your tomb. Your account's over you. Oh, I'll write a check. Typical. Full of grand gestures and too busy to pay the bills. Look, I'm afraid we won't be requiring your services anymore. Oh, aren't you satisfied with us then? Oh, yes, I'm perfectly satisfied with you. It's my husband I'm not satisfied with. Giving away our family too. Here we are. And it was such a nice tune, don't you think? Oh, well, it was two years ago, I suppose. Oh, it was. It was lovely. And now it belongs to somebody else. Oh, don't do so much. Tell me, what would you do? Well, I suppose I'd ask for it back. Well, it's a bit late for that. He's dead already. So, where is he now then? He's in our tomb. What, in your tomb? <laughs> Doesn't anybody listen to a thing I say? Yes, he's in our tomb. Oh, didn't see him there this morning. Well, you wouldn't have seen him. There's a dirty great big rock across the entrance. There wasn't a dirty great rock across the entrance. Yes, there was. No, there wasn't. There was. There was not. There must have been. I'll put it there. There was not. And the tomb looked pretty empty to me as well. If excuse me, we really must be getting along. Yes, <laughs> I do. It's empty again. It must have been grave robbers. Empty. Grave robbers. No nasty strangers cluttering it up. But what I don't understand is how they got past the guards. That means we can use it any time we like. After all, he couldn't have got out by himself, could he? Our wedding too. Could he? Oh, and he's got such a lovely...